All right, guys, hello. We are going to put on our DIY lash extensions on my right eye. Um, I have this eye already done, so this is what it's gonna look like when we are all finished. Um, I'm using the natural set today. I am using 14 naturals on um, most of my eye and then a little 12 natural on the inner corner. So let's get started. So first thing you're going to do is take your adhesive and you are going to put it all over your lashes, kind of just like mascara. I'm actually gonna flip my mirror to the other side here. Um, you don't need a super thick coat by any means, but you do wanna make sure that every single lash gets covered. I have very tiny, pathetic lashes. So I just go through and make sure that every tiny little baby lash has some adhesive on it. Especially like these little baby guys in the front. But it's essentially kind of like putting mascara on. So you just wanna make sure every lash has the adhesive. All right, I'm feeling pretty good about that. We're gonna let it dry for a minute and get tacky. Um, you don't wanna try and put on the lashes right away. You won't have success. So we're just gonna let that dry. And while it dries real quick, I'm just gonna show you what comes in the kit so when you buy the DIY lash extension kit, you are going to choose if you want volume lashes or natural lashes. Um, I'm actually putting on natural, but the kit that I just purchased was the volume kit. So it is going to come with three boxes of lashes in one box in each size. So you get a 12 millimeter, a 14 millimeter, a 16 millimeter. It's a great way to diff play with different lengths and see which ones you really like. So then you know which box you'd like to reorder. You're also gonna get black and clear adhesive personal preference um, for what people like best. I have found that I really love the black. That's what I'm using today. So I'll be using the black adhesive. It comes with the lash, Insta Lash Eraser. This is how you take the lashes off when you're all done. Super, super easy. Spray your eyes, spray it on a Kleenex cotton pad towel, um, and you just rub and it breaks up the adhesive. The lashes pull right off. They do not ruin your natural lashes at all. Um, and then you just kind of massage your fingers through your lashes to get the rest of the adhesive off. But this is magic. And then it also comes with this awesome tool that we're gonna be using to apply the lashes. You can also use your fingers, you can use a tweezer, but after using all three, I personally think this is definitely the easiest way to go. So that's everything that kind of comes in the kit when you first purchase, it's everything that you need. Um, and then you can go ahead and buy individual boxes um, as you need them. So each box has 12 lashes in them. Most people are gonna use four to five per eye. So there's kind of two eyes in a box plus a few extra. So these three boxes will get me four uses, which is basically a month. I wear them for a week and then I take them off and reply a new set. So three boxes last about a month if you're wearing them for a full week and then re reapplying a new set right away. So anyway, that's everything that comes in the kit. All right. And this is probably dry enough. We are going to go in with some lashes. So um, I have, I've already been using some, obviously put some on this eye, um, but when you get the lash, you're just going to gently pull it off. There is going to be a tiny bit of adhesive right on the very end of the lash band where it was stuck into the container. And you wanna make sure you get that off. So you can use your fingernail. It is really tiny and really thin. So I have long fingernails, so it's not quite as difficult uh, for me right now. But you can also use some tweezers, but you just kinda of wanna pick that glue off of the lash band. So there. All gone, all done. Okay, so I am going to put the lash right on my holder. If you plan on using your fingers, that's fine, or tweezers. But I'm gonna hold it right on there. And then I'm gonna take my adhesive and I am going to put just a tiny bit of adhesive right on the lash band and a little bit on the lashes. So I don't know if you can see that but I just put a tiny bit of black glue right on the band, a little bit on the lashes. This just helps it get extra hold. Like I said, you can see my lashes are pathetic. I just need all the extra help I can get and this is going to help with it. So again, we're gonna let that just kind of dry for a second. It gets tacky and sticky and that's what we want it to be. So just kind of let it dry for a quick second. And we're gonna start on the outside and go to the inside. 
So I am just making sure that my lashes are separated from my bottom lashes. And I am just going to stick this right underneath my natural lash. And it will just grab right on to the glue. And there we're good to go. And that is it. I'm just making sure oh, it's on there. You don't have to um, push it or anything right now. If it's on there, you're, you're good to go. Um, all right. And we just keep doing that all the way around. So again, get the adhesive off the band. I got a little adhesive in the lashes. You want to be really careful with this adhesive glue and make sure you only get it where you want it to go. So try not to get any on the lashes. If you do get some on the lashes, it's a lot easier. Like I caught a little bit of this dang um, adhesive from the box on the lash. It's a lot easier to pick out of the lashes when it's not on your face. So if it, you get glue on them, um, clean them, pick the glue out. You can use a tiny bit of the eraser on the lashes to try and get it out if you need to. But make sure the lashes are clean before you put them on your face. It's a lot harder to get glue off when it's already on your eyes. It is possible though. This adhesive is being a brat. Come little buddy. There it goes, come on. Okay, so again, putting it, putting it on my holder, just making sure the lashes are all nice and separated and looking good. <laughs> the more you do this, the more you get the hang of it, the easier it is. It's like anything else. Again, let that dry for a quick second. When I put on um, the next set of lashes, I'm going to try to overlap them just a little bit with the lashes that I already have on. And this is gonna help there be no gaps in your eyelashes. And that's also why I put a little bit of adhesive on the lashes because they're gonna end up sticking to each other a little bit when I overlap. So here we go, next set in. So again, I'm just trying to overlap just a little bit with that other lash so that we don't have any gaps. Second one is on. So I'm gonna end up doing four of these 14s, these kind of longer ones, and then I'll end up doing one little 12 in my inner corner. I swear picking the adhesive off is like, takes the longest sometimes. Oh, that one came off easily. I keep getting it in the lashes though. I've never had this problem before. It's because I'm filming. All right, a little bit of glue. You'll also kind of learn which angles are best um, when you're putting these on, where you need to hold your hand, where you need to hold the tool, all that kind of stuff. It's all just stuff that comes with time and with practice. All right, next little buddy on. There we go. I'm ready for my last little 12 right there in the inner corner. There's tons of fun ways to do these. You don't have to do a smaller one in the inner corner. Um, I really like that look, depending upon if you're already starting with a small length. If you're just starting out, you might like our shortest length, this 12 
all the way across your eye is really going to be a really natural look. Um, and you can also stack these. And I am going to stack one just to kind of show you what that looks like. So here's our 12. Going on inner corner, but first some glue. An inner corner is always just the trickiest, so I'm going to apologize if I stick my hand in the way because actually I don't think I'll need to on this side. Nope, we're good. Okay. There. We are all on. We are looking fabulous. Okay, now the other fun thing you can do with these is you can stack them. So you can also take, and I'm just going to stack one. Um, but you can also take more lashes and stick them on top of the other lashes that you already have on your face if you want an even thicker, fuller, darker look. So I actually have one more 14 natural stacked um, on this eye, right on the outer corner. You can see it gets a little like fuller. Oh, there I can kind of almost pull it off. Um, you could probably see it right there, but it's right there, right on the outside corner. And again, if you just want a little bit of a fuller look, a thicker look, um, this is going to achieve that for you. So you can stack one more on the outside. You can stack two on the outer outside is another popular thing to do, but we're just going to do one today. Okay, I got all the adhesive off. Nope, there's a little bit in the lashes. I think I must have adhesive on my finger that I keep getting on the lashes. Pretty sure that's what's happening. Okay, I got my adhesive going. That's the other thing too. If you notice um, your lashes are sticking to your tool or your finger, it might be because you have glue or adhesive on it, so always make sure you're keeping that clean because they should want to stick to the lashes, Whoop, not to the tool. Okay. Okay, so we are just going to literally stack this one right on top. Kind of, I'm going to try and aim for in between where my two on my end are. I'm going to stick this one kind of right in between them. So it's just going to help give a little bit fuller look um, to my outside corner. That's it. I just stuck it right on there. Um, it's right on top of those lashes. And again, just gives it a little bit of a thicker look um, on the outer lashes. And that's it. And you could do another one right here if you wanted to um, as well. So that's it, you guys. Now, all that I'm going to do is let this get dry. And then in about 30 minutes to an hour, I'm going to push right where the lashes are on my lashes, just right on top and right on the bottom. And I'm just gonna kind of smush them together to really make sure that they are sticking really, really, really well. But you wanna give your eyes just a little bit of time, um, again, to let that glue kind of get tacky and to start drying before you do that. And then I do that too um, frequently before I go to bed. I kind of just push down everything, make sure it's all good to go. In the mornings, I'll kind of do that again too, um, just to make sure everything is really sticking together. But but these will now last um, five to seven days. They just stay on your lashes all the time. You sleep, you um, shower, you work out, you do all the things, you wake up, you have lashes. They're fabulous and amazing. And then in about a week, um, when you're ready to take them off, you just spray that eraser on them, rub, they'll come right off um, and you can put a new set on. So that is it. Um, and they just, I mean, they look so fabulous. So they just are just like extensions where they are just coming right out of your natural eyelashes. There's no line up top like strip lashes um, and they're just fabulous. So let me know if you have any further questions or need any help. I can't wait to see all of your beautiful pictures with your new lashes. Bye.